Hi there, Dr. Dave here. On location in the middle of the mountains of Italy, I'm at a place called Castelluccio. Uh, it's at 1400 meters up in the mountains. We walked here yesterday, it took us eight hours across some high peaks. But here they farm, especially lentils. They grow lentils here, the kind of thing, lentils that we make soups out of and stews and dals out of. And the yellows you see in the fields around me are the lentil flowers just coming into flower and the pods are just starting to form. There are other crops here that farmers grow too. There's a cereal crop behind me which we used to make bread and uh, breakfast cereals with. But the, amongst all these farmed crops that have been planted by people are these wild flowers growing naturally. We call them weeds if they're in our gardens, but here they grow amongst the crops naturally adding to the beauty of this environment. Behind me we've got this uh, deep purpley blue are the cornflowers and uh, growing amongst them are these yellow and white of these large daisies shining in the sunshine and then poppies growing amongst the corn red and vibrant. A, a, a riot of colour adding to the colour that the farmers have introduced to the landscape. Part of God's creation displaying his wonder and glory a creation which he loves, which he, he's made in such playfulness and diversity. The different colours, the different shapes of the flowers, they attract different insects and provide for their needs. We can see the butterflies floating amongst the fields and in the back we can hear the chirp of insects. Jesus talked about the wildflowers. He said, look at the wildflowers, they're beautiful. They, they just grow, they don't have to work or strive, they're not anxious about anything. God has made them to be what they are, to be so, so beautiful and God provides for them. And Jesus said that reminds us of how much God cares for us and wants to provide for us. So perhaps when we look at the wildflowers, we appreciate how God has made the world in such wonder and we begin to uh, love what that which God has made and which God has loved to value creation and as we look at the wildflowers we remember to just as God cares for them the insects and the animals that live naturally here God cares for us and you don't have to go into the mountains of Italy to realize that you can just go to your gardens, your churchyard, your parks or around the fields into the forest and see such a variety of plants and flowers that you can find there to appreciate um, the amazing work that God has done in creation. I hope that you have a really wild and weedy adventure.